Jimmy, you and I both know that sometimes MMA judges will note if a fighter is bleeding. Happens all the time in boxing, Muay Thai, MMA. Fighters judge, I'm sorry, uh, judges judge on blood. When they see someone's hurt, when they see that blood flowing, it's hard not to, you know, count that as he's more hurt than the other guy, whether it's true or not. Sandro just spinning out of danger there. I think in this case it's true. I think, oh, yeah, he's gone! Sandro's in all sorts of trouble! An unbelievable finish! Got caught moving backwards, he moving his head, and bang! That right kick, right on the side of the head. All those punches were completely unnecessary. He was out when he hit the ground. You see her slipping, slip to his left side, right into the kick of Pat Curran. 30 seconds left, whoever puts it on can maybe ice this round. It's been very close so far. right out of this fight. What other replay could you show? Look at this, caught him leaning to his left. Watch the right that? hand to follow. Right on the chin, yeah, that, that doesn't mean anything at all. He was out when, as soon as it hit him. His footwork gets him out of the way of the one, two, even the one, two, three. You gotta make it four and five to catch Ed West at the end. Straight right hand from West. You know, none of these shots or, you know, knockout shots, even the kicks. You know, they're not knockout shots. Ed West doesn't have a lot of knockout power, but man, he throws a lot of strikes. Oh, that's it! Huge on the head kick knockout, and that is it! The first win ever by knockout or TKO for Ed West, and it comes on the straight head kick knockout. And Ed West, of course, has to make me look like an idiot, right when I said, doesn't have a lot of knockout power, what does he do? Catches him right on the jaw and puts him out. Bang! Right there, once again, wasn't a super hard kick, it was just right on the jaw. Look at that, beautiful timing, low then high. He went out stiff, man. How fast is West? After the head kick, he lands a punch. He three landed fast. three punches. Nice job, Jeremy Spoon is in the white trunks. Mike Richmond in the black trunks. Round number one. Spoon wants to get this to the ground as quickly as possible and wear down and wear out Richmond with ground and pound. Richmond wants to keep this standing, use his boxing, but he said, I'm not afraid to go to the ground with Jeremy Spoon. Straight left hand by Richmond. Head oh, kick. big head kick! That's it! And there's the finish! John McCarthy steps in, stops this fight, and it wasn't the hand, it was the kick of Mike Richmond that sends him to the semifinal round. Unbelievable head kick. We talked about the boxing. This kid can kick. Throwing hands. Bang! Left kick right on the head. That is it, man. Just grazed the temple, but look at that. Beautiful left hand follow up. The Jeremy Spoon totally stiff. It took 23 seconds for Mike Richmond to advance to the Featherweight Tournament semifinal round. Alec Williams in his first Bellator fight is in the blue gloves, and uh, Jimmy Nello in his Bellator debut. Well, the fighter from the six is a great win. A lightning quick stoppage. <laughs> head kick, power side right to the head. He had landed it before. Right kick, power side. Hand is up, but not high enough to block. It wasn't quite far enough back. In just 18 seconds, this fight went from zero to 100 real quick with Mandel Nalo. Fourteen career wins. 
for the native of Seattle, Washington. Oh, yes. He is, he is done. It is all that is over. It's going to be over. Just like that. One front kick to the face. Boom. That's what you can have. Take a look at this. Watch that right leg come up. Yeah. Bip. Right into the jaw. Dominic Clark is stunned. You can see him like, oh, 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 I can't control my body. Beautiful front kick that almost reminds you of Anderson Silva against Vitor Belfort. And just finishes the fight from there. Anderson, a black belt. Stop! Turn! Right away. Go over there. Neutral corner. Get over there. That foot and knee both come up. They are off the ground. He has one hand and one foot on the ground. That the kick by Derek Anderson hits the arm and the head. It is a legal blow. If Achilles cannot continue on, that is a TKO victory. And it is indeed a win for Derek Anderson.